Hey guys, it's Danielle. It is Wednesday, June 4th, 2014. This is going to be my week 10 pregnancy vlog. Um, so, yeah, I did a week nine. A little tired, a little confused, but things are getting good. Week 10 pregnancy vlogs. Any signs and symptoms um, have been very minimal besides being tired still. I'm still tired. Not as tired. I think I'm actually starting to get on the upswing. Um, I have a little bit more energy in the day. I don't have to nap in the middle of the day. If I can't get one in, it's not a big deal. Um, one thing I have noticed is I have an itchy port, and I don't know if what that's causing by. I haven't done anything different with my exercise, so I'm not quite sure, but my port has been extremely itchy as of late, and that's just the only weird thing that's going on right now. Um, the baby size is 1.2 inches long, and that is the size of a prune, like a mass. And yeah, that's kind of interesting. The baby is growing fast. The baby weighs 0.14 ounce, so two more ounces, and it's a pound already. That is crazy. Um, this week, um, I did lose a pound, and so I'm excited about that. Um, 169.9 right now. Um, I don't want people to think that I'm starving myself or anything. I was indulging a little too much into carbs, ice cream, popsicles, pizza, which is pizza, that's how we say. Um, a little croissant here. It, yeah, it just wasn't, I haven't been making the best choices. And so I've been talking to some of my banded girls and, um, you know, we're like, let's see if we can get in the most protein. And so we focused on protein and we're focusing on our protein again and lo and behold you focus on protein i'm not gaining any weight i lost weight actually um but my protein has been the lowest day was 80 the highest was 115. Uh, my calories have been anywhere between 12 16 2000 calories sometimes so i'm not depriving myself guys i am just choosing more protein choices instead of going crazy and eating a pretzel or something else instead. Um, one thing I have noticed though with this pregnancy is whenever I used to lay down in bed back on my flat, uh, between my hip bones, the front of them, there was like a little concave in because I had lost so much weight and then, you know, gravity pulls the skin to the sides. Now it's not so concave, it's, it's flattish and I'm pretty sure soon it'll be roundish. Um, so yeah, that's new and exciting there. Um, one thing I wanted to tell you guys with the baby is uh, I said it's the size of a prune, but now my uterus is the size of a grapefruit. Uh, so I went from an orange to a grapefruit, which is crazy. Um, so let me say I don't think there's anything else I really have to report this week. Um, yeah, I'm hoping uh, in two weeks when I'm at my 12-week mark, my pregnancy vlog and my lap band vlogs will be together in timing because if you've been keeping up with my channel, you've seen... I'm posting the weeks I recorded beforehand because obviously I just said I'm 10 weeks now, but I think I just posted week seven. So I'm putting them out probably twice a week just to get them out there. Um, so yeah, that is my plan. That is this pregnancy so far. Last week, nothing new and exciting to report. Um, yeah. Oh, I did go maternity clothes shopping. I bought a few essential pieces. I bought some shorts, some tank tops, a couple shirts. Um, but I was shopping at Motherhood, and I was talking with a friend of mine who's pregnant as well, and she's actually getting induced today. Um, but she was I asked her, how do I change my clothing size? And she said that they said to go with what you were pre-pregnancy, and I didn't know what I was pre-pregnancy because I had just gotten down to size 10 in regular pants from Target. So I wasn't quite sure what size to choose. I chose a pair of shorts and a size small. And holy shit, they fit amazing. They make me feel good and just loved them. Um, I tried on the mediums and the size, and I asked the um, the lady who works there, the sales lady. And sorry about all the noise. I have the loudest, loudest washing machine in the world. Um, but I asked her, and she said the only difference between the medium and the small, um, you know, is pretty minimal, at least on me, it looked minimal and felt very minimal. The fit was still the same. The only difference was the legs fit a little bit looser and I liked how the small spit on my legs better. Um, however, the stretchy material, holy shit, that stuff stretches forever, keeping everyone fucking around with them. And 
And that's one thing I have to work on, guys, is my sailor mouth. Mm-hmm. Where it's just like, woo! That stuff stretches forever. But she said, if the small fits fine, you'll be fine, uh, at least for the summer. So, yay, it's exciting. Um, so, yeah, even though I am pregnant and my waist is growing, I am still fitting into smalls and mediums. Um, so, that's very exciting to me. Uh, yeah, so that is it. All right, guys, I gotta go eat some some real breakfast food. Um, and I'll catch you guys later. Quick, do a little belly shot for you. Um, ten weeks pregnant, no real changes to report yet. So, but once the bump starts coming, guys, I will show it off more. Maybe, maybe I don't know. I don't know. All right, guys, hope you have a great week, and I'll catch you later.